Hello friends, welcome again to the Fresh Manor from El Bethel Ministries. We have come to a brand new year and you will hear a lot of people passing a lot of resolutions. <clears throat> maybe some will say I'm not going to smoke this year or maybe I'm not going to have alcohol this year or I'm going to stay at home more Musical than going out and partying. Re-imagined. And you find a lot of resolutions coming up from a lot of people. Sadly, before the month of January is over, people forgot what resolutions they had passed. So I'm going to try and help you how to have a successful new year, 2023. I've titled this message called The Secret of Success for 2023. In Proverbs chapter 29 and verse 18, it says, Where there is no vision, people perish. But he that keepeth the law, happy is he. So if you want happiness, look at the law. What does the law of God say? Keep the law in your heart. It's very important to read the word of God every day. Apply it to your heart. Store it in your heart and Every time you come across a problem, you have the word of God to carry you over and you will be a happy person. Many people start a year without knowing what lies ahead. They won't want to try and visualize what's going to come. But if the Lord has given you a vision, this is what Habakkuk would say to you. 2 and verse 3, it says, But the vision is yet for an appointed time. It is for an appointed time. Write it down, for it shall speak and not lie. Though it tarry, wait for it. Sometimes when God gives you a vision, the tendency is, it's taking so long. Maybe somebody was waiting for a job. Maybe somebody was waiting to get married. And it's just, things are just not happening. God would say to you, wait, wait. It's for an appointed time. In Psalms 1, verses 1 to 3, it says, Blessed is the man that walketh not in the counsel of the ungodly nor standeth in the way of sinners, nor setteth in the seat of the scornful. But his delight is in the law of the Lord, and in his law that he meditate night and day. That this is what happens to a person who meditates in the law of God night and day. He shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water that bringeth forth his fruit in his season. His leaf also shall not wither, and whatsoever he doeth, shall prosper. I can tell you without any doubt in my mind, every single one of you watching me, listening to me, wants to prosper in the new year. So what is the secret? Pay attention to the word of God. Store it deep in your heart. Seek God for a vision for the year ahead. And you will have a happy new year 2023. Father, we thank you for your word. And we ask you, Lord, that you will take your word and make it very real. Father, we pray that you will teach us the art of how to store your word in our hearts. Give us a deeper love to continue with your word. And Lord, we know if we have your word, we have everything. There's nothing that's going to be in want. We give this prayer into your precious hand. In Jesus' name, amen.